Hello, my name's Aileen and I'm married to Pat, who's lived here for many years. <laughs> I, never came, I came to Spain to stay at a friend's house in Cortia Grande. I've never been to Spain before, this was 40 years ago. And somebody said, oh, there's a young couple up here running a bar in the middle of nowhere. Well, they, they had the house just down here and turned a front veranda into, into a, a spot to go and drink a beer. And Barbara said to me one day, she said, you know, all these ruins are for sale. Well, I'd had a few by then. <laughs> so we walked around here with her and together with my next door neighbour, Ken, we, we had a look at these and we said, shall, shall, shall we buy that one? And it seemed like a good idea at the time. And the following day, I think, but my wife in those days said to me, oh, I'm really glad we did that. I said, what? Well, she said, we're interested to buy that ruin. I said, no, we bloody well didn't. <laughs> and um, anyway, we did. And we, that was 1980. And I think in about 82, maybe something like that, we got an, a, somebody to come and survey it and just see what we could do with it. <coughs> and, Build, You've build, got an architect. Just, just, yeah, just an architect, just to build on the existing ruins, which is what it is. They used, and, they used to be miners' cottages, didn't they? Mm -hmm. They were miners' cottages. They were dormitories, really. Dormitories. They were dormitories mm -hmm. for the miners, because all these doors and windows they were all along here. So how long have you been living here? Altogether? About 38 years. Mm -hmm. yeah. I was brought up in East Africa, in, in Kenya. And Aileen was born. I was born in, in India, India, and then I went to live in West Africa and well, England, West Africa, East Africa, and then the Middle East, which is where we met. Yeah. You used to have a boat, and we were both passionate about sailing, so we used to sail yeah, out. That's right. Let's have, haven't we? Both travelled a lot. Mm. Uh, mine's not quite as exciting. I was teaching, so. I was teaching in Bahrain and the Middle East and Oman. Oman was lovely, very much like this, mountains and the sea. Yeah, loved it. Did a lot of uh, <coughs> four-wheel four uh, expeditions into the mountain, camping out. Uh, I thoroughly like, enjoyed that. Yeah, very, yeah, yeah. We've got a nice circle of friends and yeah. Uh, yeah. I think friends are important, you know. We've got a nice circle of friends here. Happy. Yeah. Stay oh, we might buy something around here, you know, you know. But we just want to downsize. Yes, it's you know. four bedrooms and three lounges is a bit unnecessary. <laughs> <laughs> a bit unnecessary. And four bathrooms, yeah, <laughs> for two people. And one of the reasons we, we love living in this house is because you do have some wonderful views of the sea, the mountains and also it's not overlooked by other houses it's quite secluded yeah. so in that sense it's, you have a nice sense of privacy but the village is small enough so that you get to know people and we like there's a bar where you can congregate but also it's nice actually to get away from the playa which is a bit overcrowded in the summer and come up into the mountains where it's cooler and prettier yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we like the we like the location and we don't want to really leave, you know, we'd be mm. very happy to find something in this yeah. village because it's not too big, but it's big enough so you don't, you're not sort of <coughs> uh, on top of each other, you know, you, you can make your own life here. But yeah, we like uh, the fact that there is a bar where you can meet and they have quite a few functions there, which are quite fun. Yeah. And so, yes, it's quite, it's quite, quite jolly yeah. in that sense, but not noisy. <laughs> <laughs> Well, we had such glowing reports from your previous clients, whom we know quite well, and they have traveled the world and they said that you were the best in the world. No. So we couldn't <laughs> ask for a better recommendation. <laughs> and besides, you're a neighbor. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, thank you for interviewing yeah, us. Thank you. We thank feel you very, very privileged to have been thank you very much. Yeah. chosen to speak to you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you.